there are a lot of times that you have to take the same size, two pairs of the same size because they don't always fit the same. Sound familiar? If you've had trouble finding clothing that fits on the first try without a lot of expensive alteration, then meet Cricket Lee, who may have devised the perfect solution. A product designer, Miss Lee created a new sizing technology based on women's shapes as well as their sizes. She sifted through measurement data from more than 10,000 women and determined that women's bodies basically come in three different shapes. Straight, curvy but proportional, and round bottom or pear-shaped. But most clothes are designed for that curvy shape, which represents only 20% of the female population. No wonder nothing fits right. So what you do is you take your number, so your size is your number, and you add your shape. So for instance, I'm an 18W size, and I'm a one shape. So I'm an 18W.1. The one shape is a woman who typically gains weight around the middle. middle. The two body shapes are the typical hourglass figure. And the interesting thing about the number two shape is that we're, that is the shape that fit, was standardized on back in the 50s, that, that hourglass shape. And that's why only about 20% of the population is that shape. Shape number three is the typical pear shape. If you take and you standardize the shapes and you standardize the sizes and you put them together and then we monitor that, we certify that so that every pair of pants is the same size and shape in every brand that carries it. I'm uh -huh. amazed. <laughs> Are you really so fit? Oh, yeah, they fit great. They feel wonderful. When was the last time you wore a six? Uh, do we really want to count that many years? <laughs> so I nailed it, right? I, nailed four, it. Four, I never thought I would wear four or anything. Yeah, so turn around and see how well they fit her. She's trying to get the entire apparel industry to adopt the sizing regime. Right now, it is available in several different moderate and expensive apparel lines. Reporting from Dallas for the Wall Street Journal, this is Ann Zimmerman.